Welcome back, folks, to my brother Donnie. Today, we're going to do this front bathroom. Now, we didn't have much video of this thing as we found it, but we have this picture that we took before we did anything. So the wall's being all screwed up, and the the paneling or the whatever, the surround missing around the bathtub, it was like that when we bought it. So <laughs> we already knew it was screwed up, but we thought, oh, well, the bathroom's the main thing. So we had no idea that the whole rest of the house was pretty much just as bad. So this is what it looked like when we started, uh, and uh, hopefully by the end of the video, after we gut the entire bathroom and replace everything in it, we'll have something uh, decent that's suitable for a rent. So um, first we gotta tear out the rest of it. So let's see how bad it looks underneath that floor. It doesn't look that bad, right? It's probably all right underneath there. I should have used plywood, it'd be a little better at least, right? Yeah. So that, uh, that is basically the back side of the bathroom. So that it's not only screwed up the bathroom, it's leaked out into the living room and screwed up the living room. So what we're doing is we're taking out the bad crap, gotta get rid of it, and we'll put in nice plywood that's thicker and nicer. This is the biggest mess in the whole house. How's it going, man? Good. You can see what's left of the uh, bathtub there. Heidi's uh, in what would have been the bathtub. <laughs> we pulled the bathtub out and threw it out now, so it's gone. So obviously the whole floor needs replacing here. We're going to clean all this up put in a new floor and then uh, we'll be in a lot better shape. But this is the absolute worst of it. We've got screwed up drywall and what a mess. But this is typical because like, even in the bathroom they put down that freaking particle board stuff and you know you, you spill water out of the tub and it starts this. So you get a leak in any pipe that does this. Just bathroom's a problem. Here's where we're at with the bathroom, the hall bathroom, with the new floor. We still gotta work on the walls. And of course, the new tub's gotta go in. Still need a new vanity. We found the original uh, wallpaper. Looks like paw prints on the video, but it's not. It's uh, little bushes. We've got some flooring that we're gonna put in. Uh, we're going to put it in and run it under the tub a little bit and then put the new tub in. Well, we're getting there. It's all coming along pretty good. The name of the company that makes the bathtub is Lions. It's some kind of sign from God. Here's our bathtub, right here. Um, instead of the flimsy, flimsy uh, panels, I went with these big fiberglass panels. They do have uh, holders for your shampoo and all. We're having to tear out a little more than what we expected because we ain't got enough block in, in here to block up for the tub itself. So we had to tear out another wall or, or another panel. But we'll get it all done and get it all back in. We got the tub set and we got that one side. We got the other side sitting here. Um, but see how we got to block that in there. 
We'll get it done. And yes, we are pulling that piece of drywall out. We just haven't yet. It's going to come out from the other side. some kind of spray and foam insulation around all your pipes and all your intrusions coming up through the floor like we have done here they're in the midst of doing it over here now we're trying to get it all sealed up where we don't have to worry about air coming in we got a bathtub in got a surround in got it all ready i have not cut holes in it yet the holes are going to be right there and cut and put the the uh, you know what I'm trying to say in I've not done that yet I've got to make some of these we're going to make them out of 2 by 4 just turn them sideways and rip them rip them at a 16th of an inch or whatever that thickness would be there maybe a quarter now I'll just make them an inch and a half wide and run the strip right down through there and run another one right there run two of them there two of them there one of them there and one of them there and then we'll put up the few screw holes you know here and there and i'll run one all the way around the top see there's already one there we'll just continue that around and uh, i'll make that whatever size that is there Okay, folks, looks like we're about done with the bathroom. Pretty much everything has been completed. And boy, it looks good, doesn't it, Donnie? Oh, yeah, it looks good. All right, Donnie, now I'm going to switch you places. And then you're going to come in here and you're going to show us what all you did in here. All done. Okay. okay, now Donnie did all the work, by the way. All of it. You might have noticed earlier in the video that me and Donnie did all of the work. All of the work. Okay, so what this is this? Most important piece. Uh huh. Right here. This little jewel was one of the first things we put in. Now, is that a new one? Oh, no. That's the original. It's the original. But nice. We scrubbed it. It looks nice and clean. We scrubbed it. That's good. Okay. We scrubbed, 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 scrubbed. Okay. What else did you do in here? Put in this. Now, who laid the floor? The floor. That I did. I did it all. That's well, not what I remember. <laughs> you helped me a little bit. Yeah, like by laying all of the floor. Who could it? Notice there's no video of anybody laying the floor. Except me. That's because I was filming the videos, and I couldn't film the video because I was laying the floor. He did lay some floor. But I cut off the floor that he laid. <laughs> okay. Okay, next was bathtub. Put a new bathtub in it. Put the bathtub and the shower surround. Um, we went with this fiberglass because 
The other was like paper. Yes. Uh, this bathtub had uh, duct tape in it. Yeah, well, that one was messed up too. Not this one, but the the original one that was in here. All I saw was it on fire out back. I had duct tape in it, and I thought, you know, to begin with, when the guys moved it, they took these off and they threw them in the bathtubs of both of them. I was like, oh, they must have broke it when they did that. But I don't think they broke it because there was duct tape on it. <laughs> yeah, I don't think it had anything to do with it. So we put a new faucet in. We put the bathtub. We put the shower surround. We got that ain't been in no videos. This is the first time it's being revealed. He's very <laughs> put that in. <coughs> we uh. He's very happy about his trim ring around the shower. Trim ring. Look at that. Oh man, that's a beautiful trim ring. All this drywall's been replaced. This I just. Is, I just can't get over that trim ring. Yeah, yeah me neither. That's a good. <laughs> All right, drywall been replaced. Yeah, this drywall easy been stuff. Replaced. This drywall's been replaced. Floor, subfloor. What about that grill there? The grill's been replaced. All right, now tell us about the high water doors. Okay, I'm gonna back up. I think it's for air conditioning, but watch this. Don't it shut so smooth? It does. But anyway. I think it's for the air conditioner return, but you know. Yeah, maybe it could be for to help could air be. circulation. And the vent up there, does that work? Oh yeah, this okay, works. Okay, that works. It works. Actually, we got a video. Oh on yeah, this. we filmed a video of us uh, rebuilding that. Yep. We got a video on that rebuilding it. Uh, we'll put a link to it here, or here, or here, or here, or here somewhere. Okay. Well, what about this vanity? Yep. Brand new vanity. Brand new sink. Brand new uh, faucet. Faucet. That's it. Faucet. New lines. New drain. New <laughs> pipes. Now the the lines. Why did we need new lines? Because the pipes was too short. No. We broke all the lines. Whatever. We broke all the lines, but there was uh, there was a plastic line, and we didn't like the plastic lines. We put the uh, braided metal. Braided. That's braided the metal. most expensive one you can get, I think. They're about five dollars each. I don't know why they went with the cheapos. New, All right, new uh, electrical. Oh, he's still going. Oh yeah, new electrical. New electrical plugs. Yeah. So how many plugs did we replace? One. No, I mean in the whole house. Oh, every one of them. But yeah. We're talking about this. Okay. We got the uh, light switches. New light switches. New. This ain't the light switches. Fan switch. Yep. But. That's about all we're done in this room. All right, so that's... Oh, no, 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 no. We've done more. Quarter round. Quarter oh, round. Oh, yeah, quarter round, yep. Trim. And, and now, now the quarter round, is there anything special about the quarter round? Yes, it's plastic. It's plastic, so that it can't rot. Cannot rot. Now, is there anything special about the flooring? It's plastic. No, it's vinyl. It's vinyl. Well, the quarter well, Vinyl is plastic, though. I think yeah. you were right. The quarter round is probably vinyl, too. No, oh, that's true. Good point. They're both basically plastic. The, the door's a little dusty. We still need to sweep. Vent cover, plastic. Yep. Want to go with all plastic. The bathtub, <laughs> plastic. Glass. Now, now, let's say somebody came in here and they made a big mess in the bathroom. Couldn't I just come in here with like a water hose and just spray it all down and it wouldn't hurt? <laughs> we put high gloss paint on these walls for that purpose. We could <laughs> bring a pressure washer. If you had one of them, you know, old moments, Okay. Yep, yeah, and you could. Uh, I think. Oh, look! I can see the numbers where the the views are dropping all of a sudden. <laughs> all right, so uh, I guess that's it for the bathroom. I hope you enjoyed the video. Tell them, tell them, Donnie, what what should we say? Like, subscribe, give us a thumbs up for doing the videos, and we'll catch you on the next one. All right. Hope you enjoyed it.